Using processing, I recreated Frieder Naki's work 13965, which is one of the first computational art pieces. One of the interesting things about this piece was that he didn't know what it was going to look like beforehand because the piece was created based on a lot of random choice. So what I did was drew horizontal lines that sloped up and down based on randomly chosen increments. Um, then each of the rows were filled with vertical line segments, whether straight up and down or angular or even just blank. Um, all these choices are chosen by the processing piece itself, and afterwards it draws circles of different sizes in different places on the piece. If you run it again, you get a completely different result, which makes it a really interesting piece to observe as you see how each iteration is similar but different from the previous ones. Thanks.